What's up everybody, Tony here. I just wanted to show you guys how much do I feed my baby tilapia. Well, these are about two weeks old and I just want to show you this is how much I feed them. Well, first of all, I feed them these algae wafers. I feed them one of these algae wafers every six hours. Now, the algae, algae wafer pack looks like this. This video is not sponsored by the way, but yep. I take one algae wafer. As you can see, I snap them in half like that. All right, and I'll open my tank. I just sprinkle it down here. All right, so, so all I did was put one of them down there and then they'll come down here and they'll eat it. And then if they're really, really hungry, every hour, this is what I do. Check out my other video on how to grind your own fish food. I take a pinch of this fish food and I try to, if I'm home on the weekends or before I go to work, I try to feed these guys every hour. So I take a pinch like this and just sprinkle this on top. Rub your fingers like this, that's all it takes. And then this will fall down, just close the tank quietly. Yeah, sometimes you make, make some noise and uh, they'll, you'll startle them, but they'll go back and eat, check them out. They're all happy and they're excited. You can see them, they're growing really quick. And they're eating. Well, if you like this kind of content, hit the like button. Well, check them out, they're eating. Swimming around. It's only about two weeks old and it looks like they doubled in size already. The features are coming out more and they're eating a lot more. So when I first got them, they were only eating like a pinch of food. And then I was taking half an algae wafer and feeding them for the first couple days, feeding them half an algae wafer. That's all they were eating. And then they graduated from half to one full one. And then a couple days later, about three days later, I'm feeding them two algae wafers a day. One every six hours. And I just break them up like that, throw them in the tank, and then they'll eat. So in case they get hungry, they'll eat those. So right now, since I've put that um, pinch of fish food in there, you can see it's floating on the top of my tank and they seem to be enjoying it. As it falls, they zoom up and they see it and they start eating it. So I'll zoom, I'll move closer a little bit so you can see that. They're going crazy for it. That's what I do. How much do you feed them? You keep feeding them and feeding them, but I put a pinch every hour. And just in case the rest are not, are, the rest are hungry, they can eat those if there's not enough food. You want to keep feeding them a little bit to avoid them from fighting with each other or killing each other because they, they are cannibalistic after a while. They'll start killing each other. But so all you got to do is keep them occupied, keep them fed a little bit, and they'll be happy. All right. There's my sponge filters going, but every hour I feed them. At night I feed them. I just turn on my light, let it sit for about 10, 15 minutes, and then I'll sprinkle some of my grounded food down here, my grind food like this. Want to learn how to make your own food like this? Go ahead and check out my other video on my channel. You can see, I'll teach you how to make your own food. So it's really inexpensive. You buy these food ground up; they're pretty costly. It costs about twenty dollars for just a small amount, and that food cost me forty dollars for about forty pound bag. So that you can see the big difference. And I just take a little cup of that food, grind it up and put it in a Ziploc bag, keep it sealed, keep it right here next to my tank so that I can see every time that they're hungry, I just feed them. All right, if you like that content, hit the subscribe button. And you wanna check out all my other videos. I've got how to make your food, how to clean your sponge filter like right there. It looks like it's gonna need some cleaning. You can clean that real easily. Then you can check out all my other aquaponics videos and where these baby tilapias will go as soon as they grow up a little bit in about a month or two you'll see where they'll go out there in the aquaponics um, garden. If you like any of all those other videos, you can check out all the other stuff. Any, any questions you might have, you might wonder, oh, where did I get this kind of air from? My aquaponics videos will show you all the pumps that I use, or I actually use only one pump for air. And then I can also show you in my aquaponics video the other pumps that I use to, to circulate the water. If you want to learn how to set up or what I use on my setup, you can see that if you have any comments 
you want to see me make another video go ahead and I'll leave me a comment below all right like and subscribe and check out the rest of my videos on my channel